what when should I make a spring change? Once again, document in your notebook whenever you've made spring changes and document in your notebook. I think we're page 118 now. Um, document it in your notebook. Keep in mind though, balance is extremely important. You can't forget about making sure that the car is well balanced. Uh, how much of a spring change should we make? Well, in the front end, you know, usually 25 to 50 pounds. Um, most of the time I would change a 25 pound spring. Same thing in the rear. Uh, I wouldn't make huge swings at it because you should already have your notebook and you're tuning to your book. And usually if you have to make a big, big, big change, there's something else that's a, bit, that's a problem that you have to look forward to or look at. Once again, you know, which spring should I change? We've kind of talked about this. Balance is very important. Uh, a left front spring, keep in mind the left front off the throttle only affects the car on corner entry. It only affects it here in phase one. Right in phase one is where that left front spring is gonna have an impact. It affects the car going into the corner, so a softer spring is gonna free the car up. It's gonna help the car turn down into the corner better. Um, and like I said, what it actually does is when the car comes down on the left front, it releases side load off of the right rear. Frees the car up, helps the car turn and rotate the corner. Stiffer left front will make that corner entry in. You know, say, Kelly said, you know, he likes a lot of side bite. He wants to make sure he can feel his right rear all the time. Well, a stiffer spring in the left front is gonna help him do that. That's gonna keep the car rather than changing panard bars and changing geometry that's gonna affect the whole racetrack, changing that spring affects it two times once each corner on corner entry. So you have to look at when you start to make these changes. Yesterday we spent a whole day telling you all the changes you could possibly make on a four link to do multiple things. Now we're changing and we're actually telling you some of the simple stuff that could change. So you have to go and this is where we've studied and studied and studied this phase one, phase two and phase three. This is what the drivers got to really understand and the crews got to really understand by watching these cars because I might not want to make a big change. I might make a, a 50 or 100 pound spring change in the left front and it might cure my problems everywhere because my problem is I'm too tight or too loose getting into the corner. Well, I don't want to affect the car any place else. I just want to affect it here. So that might be your spring change. Just like Ben said also yesterday, shocks. Shocks definitely are another good tool that allow you to make minor changes so that you don't upset the whole car by making a geometry change by moving a panard bar or trailing arm or whatever. So keep that in mind. These changes are changes that you can use.